These are the top 5 YouTube events of May 2016. Number 5. Vitaly ZDTV Arrest Prankster Vitaly ZDTV climbed the Hollywood sign on May 25th, waving a flag that says, I'm back. He got arrested but bonded out the same day. The I'm back sign hopefully means Vitaly is going to make good pranks again. Number 4. Overboard Humor A YouTuber with over 1.6 million subscribers, Overboard Humor, made a 43 minute video talking about some very personal things in his life. Overboard Humor told his fans that his wife actually got arrested for domestic abuse, and now Overboard Humor has custody over their child. Overboard Humor also announced that he isn't making enough money at the moment to support his child and started a GoFundMe page. Overboard Humor makes great videos and seems like a really good guy, so if you want to help him out, I'll link his donation page below. Number 3, Roman Atwood. Some controversial videos of mega famous YouTuber Roman Atwood leaked on May 27th. One of the videos shows Roman with his friends pretending to be mentally handicapped. Another video shows Roman with one of his friends who is mocking African American rap artists. Roman Atwood's friend was in blackface, which is very racist and messed up, and calling himself Little Chimp. Here, watch. See what's on? Little Chimp records. Little Chimp. However, these videos are from over six years ago, and Roman is a completely different person today, and would never do something like this again. Number two. BF vs GF Breakup The insanely popular YouTube couple Jesse and Gina, with over 18 million combined subscribers, broke up a few weeks ago and announced they are done daily vlogging. And on top of that, Jesse announced on Twitter that he may have a 14 year old daughter named Lucia that he has never even met. Interestingly, if you look at some of their older vlog titles, it seems like they were dropping hints towards this for quite some time. Number 1 H3H3 gets sued. Ethan and Ela Klein, the creators of H3H3 Productions, announced this month that they were getting sued for copyright infringement by Matt Hawks. This made the YouTube community furious because the video Ethan and Ela were getting sued for is clearly protected under fair use. YouTuber Philip DeFranco started a GoFundMe page for Ethan and Ela, which raised so much money that Ethan and Ela decided to do something amazing. Ethan and Ela decided to use the money raised to start the Fair Use Protection Account, or FUPA. FUPA is basically a YouTuber union run by lawyers that will protect small YouTubers who get unfair copyright claims and strikes. Just the existence of FUPA alone will give copyright holders a reason to think twice before copyright claiming a video that is protected under fair use. This was one of the first times that the YouTube community came together to protect a YouTuber who was being unfairly punished.